what's up guys uh back again with a shattered goho replay um looking at this base you can see the cc radius sits outside a couple defenses so you can pull the cc fairly easy uh this clan was not using any sort of hounds or anything which made it pretty nice for uh cc pull and double poison burn off um, this is a little bit more technical base, and when we talk about that, this has lots of double bomb spots, and I didn't quite know where they were, so that could be a double bomb, double bomb, double bomb, double bomb. Uh, this could too, although I'm thinking there's probably Teslas, he might have a single bomb, just wouldn't make sense to be there. The hogs would path around it, it wouldn't blow up. So with the four remaining spots, I needed to take them out, get to the queen without her aggroing on a golem, and figure out how to get to the other two double bomb spots. So you break it down even further. Um, with this base, the queen is sitting right by two possible spots here's an outside anchor point if i put a golem over here she can shoot them so i'm going to put my golems up here and just use a jump a jump perfectly placed here will get me into the mid zone in here this bomb spot and take care of these defenses for that bomb spot so now we're only looking at two bomb spots left so how do you run your hogs to deploy these or detonate these double bombs without getting them so yeah i think there's double bomb would be here and probably here now we can come from the back side of this double bomb or if you hog in this path as soon as your hogs hit here they'll run across over here only detonating one double bomb as long as you can bring hogs up through this mortar and into the cannon you can hit that back bomb spot first not a problem now for this bomb spot i gotta figure out how to detonate it without killing my hogs so I'm going to bring a couple hogs up here and let them work around till they get to here. Once they get to here, they're going to jump up. But I don't want them hitting here and running up here. So at the same time, I'm going to make sure I have hogs hitting here and coming down just as my hogs reach this point. That way I can take the top off it. And if my hogs come up, then separately they'll take the bottom off it. You'll see the plan works out perfectly. Let's take a look at my troops, my setup. You see I brought two poisons for the CC kill. I knew it was not a hound. Um, I didn't know what it was, so you'll see I had to do a little side poison lay. But anyway, then I'm going to bring a golem over here and a golem over here. Reason being, these defenses will shoot there and there. And I can make my funnel cut way over here. Nothing can hit it. I can make my funnel cut way over here. See a wide funnel cut, start on the outside first, work your way in, and then it's simple simple spells and uh, troop lay after that. Like I said, with that jump, I want to make sure it covers just like that. Um, that way my troops will get around and they'll do the damage they need. The heal spots, you know, I'm definitely going to make sure it heals over that double bomb. Heal would be on that splash and heals over that double bomb because I'm going to take apart those double bombs separately. Now I pick up, I use both my poisons, pick up a lot of skellies at the end that we'll see. And uh, they're eating away at my hogs, but I did it quick enough. It wasn't that big of a deal. And see, I pulled out the CC and here I was sitting counting. Um, I think I had the whole CC out, but this name was over. I couldn't count them. I saw I had one, two... That's a Valk. I see another Valk archer, and I didn't know what that one is. So I didn't want to risk it. I sent one more hog to make sure I had the full CC, and boom, out pops out a witch. So I realized maybe I didn't have the whole CC like I thought I did. Now the troops are separated, so got to see if I want to combine them. And I realized now you got two poisons. I can just poison each pack separately. So poison up the Valks with that max poison. I know that will eat them. Hit the other one on the witch. She has low HP, so not a problem. CC's gone, taken care of. And I come in with my golems, one from one side, one from the other side. Throw up my wizards so they can start eating up uh, that funnel for me. I want to see if I can get some wizards over and kill off that mortar. They'll do it. 
Realize I'm taking up some time, so time to put in my heroes, throw down that jump spell, get in my queen, and maybe a few more backup wizards just to eat through all that junk on the side. King goes over, takes care of the queen. I don't see any bombs popping in that spot. I see Tesla's popping up, so I know my bombs are going to be somewhere else. Here I start in my hogs. So I wanted to make sure there wasn't a bomb here, so you can see I put my hogs in separately. I thought that mortar would get taken care of, but now my hogs run over this portion. You can see how I set them in to kill that mortar real quick so this pack didn't come over. Now as they run over, no bombs are popping, so I know there's got to be a bomb here. My troops are finishing up over here. I know they're going to go over here, so I put a big pack to take out that and hopefully pop the lid off that top bomb. Throw the heel down. And there's that top bomb. So that double bomb's taken care of. I know I don't have to worry about the second one. I'm getting a bunch of skellies on me now, so I throw in that extra heel. And then this is what I exactly I was talking about coming from the bottom. So I knew if my troops met up here, they would hit that bottom of the cannon and take off the the back side of the double bomb before moving over the queen and hitting the other one. So they're doing it separately. They're getting healed the whole time. And that's it. That's how you weed out double bomb spots. This had four possible spots. You got to break down the base separately. Take care of each double bomb. Ball game. Three star. So could be a tough base. There's a lot going on, but setting your golems right getting your hogs to path where you want them, taking either top or bottom route for each double bomb set, that will get you the three star. Hope you guys liked it. Um, you know, this is another good win for our clan. There's a lot of updates going on. That double poison's nice. Let me know what you guys think, if you got any other issues, problems. I'm still liking hogs. You know, I'm still doing a lot of attacks. If there's hounds in the CC, I'm throwing in that hound attack. But uh, hogs are still working good for me. Even better with the double poison. Alright, see you guys next time.